Good morning, y'all. Kind of chilly here today, so I thought I would make one of my favorite meals. It's pretty easy to make one pot other than some chopping. It's called shakshuka. It is, it is, I can't talk this morning. It is an Israeli Middle Eastern dish. What I've got in here is about half of a large onion and a couple cloves of garlic. You're going to find a lot of recipes for this. Traditionally, fresh tomatoes and a lot of tomato paste. And I love tomatoes, but I don't have many fresh ones at this moment in time. So, I'm going to use what I have. And then I went ahead and pre-chopped um, a bell pepper, kind of finely diced, and about four green onions. Yeah, I'm an onion freakazoid. So let's get that dumped in there. Salt. Pepper. Just going to stir this up until the vegetables start to wilt. See, I am just a mess. Pretty, huh? Your protein in this is going to be eggs. You can increase your quantities of this to make it whatever size you need if you're feed, feeding a lot more people or anything. So um, you're going to end up dotting your eggs in wells all around your vegetable mixture once they have cooked down somewhat. I will be back when these are a bit wilted down and I'm going to be adding in about a pint of my home canned tomatoes because that's what I have on hand and that is the good thing use what you have and customize it and make it your own so I'll be back okay and I'm back so my shakshuka now has the tomatoes added into peppers green onion regular onion actually it was yellow and um, garlic. That's all that's in here other than salt and pepper. So it's been cooking down and now I'm going to add my eggs in. So you're just going to make a well. And I'm going to put a couple eggs in here. Again, this is your only protein is the egg. So you're actually eating pretty healthy, just vegetables. And I do crack my eggs because I don't want to eat blood. Oh, score. In goes the other one. I'm going to put, I have Himalayan salt here. I'm going to put a little more salt on the top because of all the tomatoes I put in. And a little more pepper. There we go. And now what you're going to do, I've had my heat on like um, medium. Now I'm going to turn it down just a little bit. It's kind of between medium low and I'm going to cover it with a lid and we'll be back when they're done okay it's been about six seven minutes I guess and I'm gonna pop the lid off and I'm going to see if these are finished oh there we have it there we have it finished shakshuka and just, you know, divide it out in servings according to where your eggs are. And it is a pretty good breakfast, actually. Very warming, especially on these cool, cool mornings that we have coming for the next couple days. Hope you guys enjoyed it. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Bye.